Hey, what's up, Sarge? Nothing, man. Get ready to go over to the backyard beat down today, man. We're gonna put it on Webby for all that mean stuff he's done forever, ain't we? Dang right, man. I can't wait to see the look on his face when we beat up him and all his cronies and he's just laying there and he's sad crying payback for all the mean stuff. Yeah, get the boys out there, soldiers, man. We got, man, I just can't wait to see you, you know, out there doing Sergeant Seven stuff, out there freaking tearing them up, busting with Lucky Seven, seeing Debo, man, breaking their necks, man. And Alabama Iron Man, we bust him with that Alabama Slammer, man. It's over with, man. Those guys, that ain't none of Webby's cronies can just hang with us, man. Oh, I know, I just can't. Man, I just can't wait, man. We'll see how it goes. It's going to be good. So, yeah, I'm, I'm probably going to finish getting ready. And then, uh, man, we'll see you out there, okay? I'll come get y'all. All right, so don't, don't remember, don't come to back here and be down on your own. Wait on me to come pick you up, okay? All right, man, we're going to roll in in style. All right, man. See you. Andrew. I am so sorry. I tell you, I am so sorry. I have seen my ways. I have been a douche for three or four seasons now. Yeah, you have. I don't want to have anything to do with Boot Hill soldiers. Yeah, dang right you don't. I hey, know I that I know, hey look, I know they're going to come and kick all our asses now, okay? That's right, because I, they are. I, I am so, so sorry. Well, you look, ought to be sorry. Look, as a matter of fact, as a gift that I have for you, for silly so sorry. A giant Mountain Dew, just for you. Well, we used to drink them together back when uh, you knew how to act, right? I'll even pour it for you. Well, you should. You, you get some of it for you, too. We'll share it, I guess. Here. You know, you just because we're brothers. You take the majority of it. Just because we're brothers. So you're telling me we're done. I don't need to bring my friends and the soldiers and whoop you. Oh, no. Because I know, and everybody in Backyard Beatdown knows, that you're going to kick our sorry asses. That's right. Well, at least you know now. Tastes just like Mountain Dew, baby. It is. It is straight Mountain Dew. I feel tired, dude. What'd you? I didn't do anything to it. Let me. I can't. You tricked me. Look at that sorry piece of crap. Hey, over here. Look at that sorry piece of crap. <laughs> See you next month, Boot Hill Soldiers. <laughs> so here I am, Andrew, here in the damn chicken. <laughs> Here in the chicken pen. And I tell you what. First I knock you out. First you pass out. The next thing I'm going to do. Is I'm going to get a hold. Of one of your disgusting. No good. Chickens. And I'm going to sling their neck. And I'm going to get them. And I'm going to take them. And I'm going to fry them up. And I'm going to have a. Tell me. Boy, that was some run, Coach Webb. No, excuse me, Andrew. That was some run in the chicken house, in the pen. But I tell you what, look at this feast. Look at this feast. 
all, one, two, three, six pieces of chicken that I have to eat. And just for you, I put it on a plate where there's a farm in the background. I sure did. And you know what, Andrew? You piece of human waste. You piece of garbage. You piece of crap. I am going to enjoy every bit of this chicken. Mmm. That's good. Mm. That's some good chicken. Here, let me dive into another bite. <sighs> yeah. To top it all off, I got something for you. This egg. You know what this egg is? This egg is the Boot Hill Soldiers. And it's going to get cracked, smashed. Just like that. By the hands of the corporation. Because when it's all said and done, Andrew, you will find out that the corporation always wins.